Yo, yo, what's good, everyone? Welcome to my channel. Today, I will be doing the sun, moon, rising of Scorpio. So, let's get into it. So, my angels, do we got the Scorpio? Y'all know I'm going to say you rise. I ain't got to say that. So, with ecstasy. So, you're no longer chasing thrills. You're no longer allowing, you know... Low vibrational energies, you know, to interfere in your life. <laughs> With ecstasy in reverse, this is really giving, like, you know the stage that when you're single, you become single, and you start dealing with people, you start dating people, and you got, like, you know, you're just single, you just want to have fun because you you enjoying it being single, and it's like, you could have been dealing with someone, it's like you're no longer attracted to or excited about things that used to be thrilling to you. And this can be shit from your past with memories at the bottom. Just people from your past, period. You're no longer excited about people from your past. It's a turn off. So... You know, you know, fucking people from your past, period. Yeah. And this, and this could be like a bittersweet, you know, situation because you thought like, you know, somebody was your all, you know. You know, only you, you know, baby. And that's how you could have been telling somebody. And it's just, no, you're just not with that no more. Yeah, with distance. Like, I can't further emphasis on the you just don't feel the same way of how you used to feel with this distance being here it's some type of separation here space blockage distance and it's causing somebody else to have a heart ball i would say this is you but no somebody feel as though you're giving them mixed signals they feel as though your emotions are blocked. They feel as though you're messed up. But, no. You're just not interested in them anymore. <laughs> yeah, with well, hopelessness. <laughs> like, bitch, please. So, somebody, <laughs> like, it, it's, it's delusional. So somebody thought you was sinking in despair. They thought you was falling apart. They thought you was hopeless. I'm saying that no. <laughs> you know your worth. You know your beauty. You know that you're charming. You know <laughs> you're graceful. <laughs> yeah, this is somebody who tried to scapegoat you. With escaping, avoiding, blocking, pushing away. Yeah, somebody tried to push you away. And I guess they thought you was affected about them scapegoating you because well hopeless being here somebody thought you was gonna be hopeless by them scapegoating you so somebody could have been like oh you was out here chasing thrills or whatever like that but in actuality no you just don't fuck with them with distance here <laughs> yeah yeah somebody's crazy exactly somebody's stressed okay it's causing them tension Okay. And it's because they was pretending. They was wearing a mask. You could have called somebody's bluff a long time ago. This could be the reason why you distance yourself. <laughs> like, are you kidding me? Mm. Yeah, somebody is confused. I also heard somebody can't get high off you no more. Like, you could have been someone's high. You could have been getting somebody, you were somebody's muse, that's what I'm getting. You were somebody's excitement, okay? You 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 brought somebody something. I don't know what it was, okay? But when you distance yourself from them, <laughs> they thought they was affecting you. This is somebody who was a blockage in your fucking life. That's what it's giving. Yeah, clarity, confusion. You have clarity. They're the ones confused. Because this, like I said, this is somebody who thought that, <laughs> ugh, I like, for real. 
Yes. Somebody wanted you to be confused about your divine masculine or divine masculine. Somebody who you put distance between this bitch thought you was pressed. Okay, they thought that you know you was, you know, having a good time. <laughs> this is somebody who thought that you was falling apart about them. Like for real. It's giving I don't know what the fuck it is. Like I said, they're confused. Divine masculine. And for my feminists, somebody wanted you to be confused about your divine masculine. And what, what do I mean about being confused? This person didn't want you to be excited. They wanted you to put some distance between you and your divine masculine. <laughs> they wanted you stressed, going through turbulence, tension, and arguments with your divine masculine. Kids, you're not. They wanted you to be in this heart fog. When it came to your divine masculine. Yes, intimacy. I'm saying that you and your divine masculine is spending time with each other. Y'all are bonding. Y'all are confiding in each other. And now somebody that's on the outside is confused, period. Somebody thought that you was waiting on them. No, you're in a relationship with your divine masculine. Yes, you have clarity. I'm also hearing for my divine feminists. If you're not dealing with your divine masculine, this is somebody who was waiting. They was in some type of cycle. Okay. And they got clarity now. And they want to return. This is somebody who tried to push you away. Well, escape. And they tried to scapegoat you. Try to put something on you. Try to say you was the reason why something happened. <laughs> yeah. They wanted you to chase after them. This is why they were silent towards you. It's giving coward. Yeah. Somebody was in a cloudy judgment. This is why they mistaken you and release you. Now this person is in sorrow. <laughs> They're in fucking pain because they feel trapped with somebody. Because the chemistry is with you. But they got a family with someone else. They want a second chance. Because they're realizing... <laughs> That, you know, you could be very intuitive. Hmm. Somebody is trapped, bro. They feel stuck and captive. Hmm. Yeah, but they got chemistry with you. They got a family with somebody else, though. But they want a second chance because they realizing that your intuition was right this is somebody that's wanting to manifest you but you set some boundaries up yeah they want to come in your life they want a second chance but because i guess this person was unbalanced distorted this person could have touched something out on you and now they feeling trapped with somebody else because they got a family with them but they want a second chance with you so i mean i don't know me personally i say move on because <laughs> The third parties is a no-go. Yeah, somebody's in their head because love is on their brain. This is somebody that's thinking about you. Like, a <laughs> baby come back. <laughs> you can't make me know me. Yeah, somebody is threatened because somebody is into you. They're hooked. <laughs> so somebody is bothered, okay? I already told you because you and someone else have good chemistry. Y'all are a great vibe. It's very positive and this person could be hooked on you. So somebody is wanting to come around with these fake ass smiles. I mean, let me see because what's this fake smiles about? I'm a tarot. Angels, tell me what's this fake smile about? Who, who is this? High Priestess. Four Swords. Yeah, listen to your intuition. Lay something to rest, Queen of Cups. The world. Because you already closed out a karmic cycle. So, yeah, um, I'm also hearing... <laughs> For real. Yeah. Somebody thought you was faking. Is what I'm hearing. Mom? Yeah, boo. I'm coming. I'm also here in Scorpio with this face now with this high priestess queen of cups. This could be a Pisces. This could have been
even a Pisces, a fake ass bitch smiling in your face, threatening because you and your person had a positive vibe. Yeah, this is about it that you already laid something to rest with. You already closed out this cycle. Yeah, with the scrim card, you already staying 10 toes down on some shit. And somebody heartbroken. Queen of Wands, because they understanding that, yeah, you're standing on fucking business. <laughs> yeah. With this Queen of Wands, I'm saying that you acted on something. That's what I mean when you standing on business. Like, yeah. You took zero. It took you not even five seconds to, oh, yeah. Yeah, you get, get up out of here. Yeah, because somebody was sitting, threatening. How you threatening about my relationship, ho? Like, get you a man. Yeah, with the two of swords, somebody tried to target you. Temperance, because you was in harmony. Four of cups, and they wanted you to miss the opportunity. Six of wands, because you was getting public recognition. You was getting your flowers from people. So people could have been congratulating you. Telling you, oh, congratulations for this and this and that. Oh, I see you, this and this and that. And they ain't like it. So they was out this bitch doing magic. Up to three bitches. Because somebody wanted to make a love offer to you. Two of cups. Somebody wanted to partner up with you. You got a king of pentacles here. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. We're getting strong Taurus. With this bull. Mm-hmm. And this three of wands. Yeah, this is somebody. This Taurus is at a distance from you. And with the ace of swords, that's the truth. Five of swords. This person was playing mind games with you because you was the empress. Chariot. So I'm hearing this, this was a Virgo as well. Oh, we got a Taurus, Virgo, and possibly someone's or the mother of a Cancer. I'm hearing three different. Oh, yeah, I'm hearing three. I got channel messages. So look, one is one. I guess it's three. It's three people. One is a Taurus. One is a Virgo, and the mother of this Cancer. These are the three people who wanted you to be what the fuck they thought you were, and they had the nerve to be witches doing conjuring magic on you to fuck with your fucking mind. Cause you was this empress, ace of swords, and you knew the truth. Cherry about a cancer. I'm also seeing you know the truth about a car, a red car, when it came to somebody's mother, what they did. Mm-hmm. Yeah, and a Virgo, lover of theirs. Six of swords. They thought they was gonna be able to move the common waters. Ten of wands, heaven no. Hell no. Hell no. I'm about to expose them. That's what I'm doing right now. You got a Virgo. And this cancer's mother. What's her sign? I, yes, the Virgo is the father. The mother or the mother is the Virgo. The kids can be Virgos too, bro. So if it's not the mama or daddy that's a Virgo, it's one of the kids that's a Virgo. Look at this card. Nine of Wands. They took this impulsive ass action. Nine of Swords. Nanny. Whoa, it was me. Oh my God, I did do that to her. Oh, I did do that to them. Seven of Swords lying on you. Trying to get away with shit. Stealing from you. Eight of Cups. Now they trying to walk away. Eight of Swords. But they too late. They're stuck. This is somebody who is now mentally stuck and trapped. And if they did steal from you, this person is going to get arrested. With the Seven of Swords, Eight of Cups, they're going to be walked out in handcuffs. Look. They're going to be walked out in handcuffs. Page of Pentacles for coming up with this motherfucking plan with a King of Swords. Double to bind you. Yeah, this could have been an Aries. So if it's an uh, Aries and Virgo, couple will bind by the devil. King of Swords, they should have made a practical decision. Actually, they should have made a head of a heart decision. Hey, man. Because they sabotage their stupid asses. Emperor, this father, six of pentacles. So, this could have been the father of a Taurus who wanted to take something from you. Oh, he sabotaged this up. Right along with his hoe. Or his bitch, whatever they want to be. Nah, because look at them. They with the devil. They hoes and bitches. Fuck that. Yeah, they under judgment. Five of Pentacles for car. For, you want to know why they under judgment? They under judgment because you actually call judgment. These are people who wanted you to struggle with your kid. So say if you have a son or a daughter, they wanted you and your son, you or your daughter, left out in the cold, struggling in the wintertime. Moon. So this is why they did some illusion magic behind the scenes. This could have been moon magic. 
to create an illusion. Nine of Pentacles, but you did something alone. <laughs> you did something alone. So you're so sufficient and independent because <laughs> you did this alone. You work by yourself. Ten of Swords, yeah. Somebody tried to betray you. Ace of Pentacles for money. Eight of Pentacles, so they did work on you. Nine of Pentacles to slow up your finances. Death card to actually end your finances. Five of Wands because they was envious and jealous of you. A King of Cups. Yep. Yeah. A King of Cups. So we got a, a, a Scorpio and an Aries. Mm -hmm. The Aries is the witch. The Scorpio. Hmm. She, she or he cloaked this up. This King of Cups. This could be a Cancer or a Pisces. I don't see Scorpio. Even though we know the King of Cups is Scorpio. The Duff is here. So we know Scorpio is right here. This is a Pisces or a Cancer. So we got a Scorpio, Cancer, Pisces, Aries. These people work together to cause you a tower or to cause you some chaos in your life, man. Yeah, with the Page of Swords. And they was watching. Knight of Cups. This Pisces. Hierophant in this Taurus. Page of Cups. Mm, 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 mm. So, I'm being told to warn you, watch this Pisces and this Taurus. They're going to try to come towards you. This Pisces, this is fake ass love. This person did magic on you. And this Taurus, this person tried to play God and you and your person's life. And now they're trying to apologize. Queen of Swords. Because you made a head over hearted decision and you cut their ass off. King of Wands. And you took leadership in your own life. Knight of Swords. And that's why somebody attacked you. That's the main reason why they attack you. I'm also hearing you had a King of Wands, Aries, Leo, or Sash attack you over some he say, she say shit. Ace of Wands with candle magic, Eight of Wands, and that shit is backfiring. Six of Cups, because in the past, Ten of Cups, you could have been, you know, helping this person. I'm, I'm, I'm seeing like you could have been this one. Not the girlfriend, but this one. You could have been helping them with their child, their newborn child. And they did this to you? <laughs> you helping them build their relationship. And this is what they did to you? All because of he say, she say? Yeah, with the nine of wands, this Sagittarius is burnt the fuck out. Star card, because you are a healer. Three of pentacles. These people work together. Two of Pentacles to cause you an imbalance. See your finances, see your stability. But with the eight of, but with the two of Pentacles, you see that eight. You are a limitless being. <laughs> Things come to you easily and quickly. <laughs> you are a money magnet. <laughs> like what they thought they was doing, and all three of them are being exposed. So one of them could be pregnant. She could be. I don't know. These bitches are being exposed. Seven of Wands for trying to block you. Nine of Cups because your wishes was coming true. Seven of Cups and they wanted to create an illusion. Two of Wands and that was the path they chose. Four of Wands at a home. Four of Pentacles to try to hold you back. Seven of Pentacles. They was heavily invested. Five of Cups because they was going through losses. <laughs> they was going through regrets. And now they're getting fucking karma. Whoever this Queen of Pentacles is. Taurus, Virgo, Capricorn. Mm-mm-mm. Yeah. Because the wind is turning in your favor. Page of Wands. Even though somebody tried to become some type of block in your path. Like, bitch, get some more with your life. It's getting, please. Like I said in the beginning, somebody thought that they were stopping something. Like, they thought that, like I said, somebody thought that, oh, they could say you was this ecstasy person. This person that was just this prostitute. Like, girl... And the whole time, these bitches the ones out here fucking off on bitches' friends and family members and shit. Like, bitch, fix your life. Yeah, Six of Pentacles, they wanted you to be bread come Ten of Swords. Or they wanted to take something from you. Ten of Swords. And they felt like they had to defeat you in order to take it from you. But one thing about it, two things for sure. They the ones that's under karma. I'm under, under karma, not you. So, I hope it was worth it, you know? Because the motherfuckers is definitely trapped in some shit. I don't know what they trapped in, but they definitely trapped. Yeah. Because you a professional. 
That's why it was stopped. <laughs> People weird. Yeah, something is about to come to an end. Okay. To this old couple. Yeah, there's an old couple here. Mm-hmm. This is an old couple here that's about to go through a loss. For being in a pride and motherfucking ego. Because you out here sleeping good at night. Because you a reader. <laughs> the fuck they threw it. Yeah. I'm saying that you held back. Because you could have got that download. That this was a lesson. That you need to learn from. <laughs> fuck wrong with them. Like I said. Something is about to end for this old ass couple. The fuck. They tried to make you go through a loss. Like. And this could. Like, not even trying to come for no old people because I respect my elders. <laughs> you know? Yeah. Judgment. Their de death is judgment. Uh, what? Judgment is... What? Death is their judgment. Oh, my God. Oh, my God. I'm also saying that something is coming to an end because you answered your spiritual calling. <laughs> Nine of Wands. Somebody is the wounded warrior. Ten of Pentacles. This family. Yeah, this whole family is defensive. I'm also saying that you could be defensive towards a whole family. Two of Wands because of the path they chose. Ace of Swords. Yeah, you know the truth. Six of Wands. They did this for clout. Six of Swords. So you're moving on. Three of Pentacles from this group of people. Four of Wands. You and your twin flame. Who worked with this couple? I'm hearing. Why is he trying to love you? Ten friends. Five of Wands. I'm hearing somebody tried. To, oh my God. Oh my God. No. Somebody tried to end your soulmate contract. But both of you guys were able to balance it. And people are mad. They're mad. Star card. Because y'all healed. Five of swords and y'all defeated these motherfuckers. Oh my God. Y'all defeated them when y'all healed each other. So you and your person, y'all balanced. And this is why people are arguing, competing, all this shit going on because y'all healed and defeated these motherfuckers. Now they want to apologize, but they're under fucking judgment. Mm-mm-mm. I ain't want to keep saying like somebody want to fuck with your soulmate. So I was like, you know, yeah, this queen of pentacles lost. Come on, y'all. Y'all cannot. T Look, that's the truth. This queen of pentacles lost. Ace of swords. That's the truth. Okay. Now, who is this queen of pentacles? Somebody who wanted money. They knew you were innocent. They knew you was the divine feminine. Whoever this Taurus is. But they still created an illusion. Then they got to walk away. Because you are the victor. You know? It is what it is. Who cares? Why is pride here? Yeah, they were in their ego. In their pride. Yeah, this queen of pentacles. Two of wands. This is why they chose this path. Four of supposed to lay something to rest for you. Five of pentacles. Because they wanted you to go through poverty, hardship, sickness, scandals. But with the ten of wands, it got too hard. Emperor, because you call back all your energy. Oh, oh, it got too hard for this person to try to control your divine masculine. King of Swords, because he's smart. Magician, and he's a ma Oh, shit. So your person is a magician, too. Yeah, so something was too hard. Because <laughs> they was manifesting on their own. And they was like, I be down. <laughs> yeah, they had all their energy. You could be dealing with a cancer. If you are dealing with a cancer, this person is the emperor. King of Swords, magician. This motherfucker can even manifest at you, hon. Yeah, with the three of wands, this motherfucker is waiting for his money to come in so that he can have a brand new beginning with his empress, you. Divine feminine. And he gonna keep this away from people. That he's walking away. Like, he's not fucking with them. Like, yeah. So I guess your person is being a little bit more discreet when it comes to y'all partnership. He No, he's not playing. And I'm also hearing whoever this queen of pentacles is, she lost him. So this could even... I'm going to wait till I get it because this could have... Nah, I ain't even going to... Yeah, what I say, this could have been their brother or sister. That Queen of Pentacles could have been their brother or sister. They lost this person as a brother or sister. Seven of Swords for stealing from them, for lying to them. Sad. 
all of this because they was in their pride and ego wanting to compete. Like, girl, you could have avoided all this shit by minding your business. What the hell? Look at this shit. Queen of Pentacles again. Five of Cups. It's in regret. Star card that you healed yourself. Five of Swords because you defeated them. Page of Cups, they want to apologize. Page of Pentacles for coming up with some plan. Scrap card been in their ego. This could have been a Virgo. Five of Wands who was in competition with you. Scrap, bro. With this scrimp card coming out, this could have been a fucking Leo and a Virgo. Couple. That was envious and jealous because you was an earth angel. And you was partnering up with a cancer, past life soulmate. And they wanted to take that from you. Because it was their wish fulfillment. So they was out here creating illusions when it came to your love life. Because they wanted you to walk away. So that they could be seen as the victor. Bitch, if you don't move your, if you don't move your weird body ass around, man... It be the Lily, it, it be the Lily, not even Lily, I didn't mean Lily, I mean Lenny from Shark Tales, that's how you know niggas be bitches, like, it be, yes, this is a Virgo with the Nine of Pentacles, look, this is a Virgo, Eight of Pentacles, who did work on you, Ace of Swords, that's the fucking truth, Seven of Swords, this bitch had the nerve to be lying to you in front of your fucking face, Three of Swords, trying to break your heart, trying to distort you, and then this King of Wands, Aries, Leo, and Sag, Eight of Wands was heavily projected on you, Nine of Wands, and didn't want to give up, Nine of Cups, to their wishes came true, this could have been a Sagittarius and a Virgo, boy, these people better get their shit together, yeah, Axe, it says, forces working against you, flute, disappointed in a friend or a lover mm -mm -mm. younger man dealing or relationship with a younger man camel persevere and you will overcome a problem that shit is in reverse yeah this is family that's weeping now because they're in fucking sorrow because they won't shit about the end for you but they was gonna take a loss yeah mm -hmm. that's what's going on it's giving weird body energy yeah, a creepy masculine watching and stalking you needs to get a life. The fuck? Yeah, you got a false twin here that doesn't believe in God, but believe in the devil. Silly, silly. Yeah, wants clout off your downfalls. <laughs> and wrong, wrong fucking move. Because they blocked their own fucking path. This is somebody that got sex addictions. And... This is affecting this person. So let's see who it is because I'm going to be nosy now. Who the hell is this creepy masculine, angels? Well, not like that. Who is this creepy masculine? Fool, an Aries or a Leo? This is somebody who knows that you're innocent. But they're in a group with people that's envious and jealous of you. With the Eight of Swords. This can be somebody that's locked up. And they're envious and jealous of your innocence. So this creep is also powerless. Okay, well, I seen the Empress. So don't worry about this stupid motherfucker. Yeah, with the Eight of Wands, somebody is projecting on you. And they need to get a life. A Virgo and a Gemini. Yeah, somebody think they can rush towards you. Like, girl, get your life. Or a pinnacle. So, this person tried to hold you back. This could have been a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn that wanted clout off your downfall. And that was the wrong move. Because with the Eight of Cups, you only walked away from them. And now you're holding back from them. And them doing that, it literally really blocked their path. Like, I'm not even playing. So, who is this person that doesn't believe in God but the devil? A Knight of Pentacles. A Virgo? Page of Pentacles that's been studying you. Seven of Swords, this bitch is a liar. <laughs> yep. I heard the devil is a liar. <laughs> exactly. Why is false twin here? For Scorpio? Four of Pentacles. This could be a Taurus, Virgo, or Capricorn. Whoever it is, they holding on to you. And with the Eight of Cups, you already walked away from them. Seven of Wands and blocked them. Death card ended it. Hierophant. Yeah, because this person tried to play God in your life. Or they wanted you to conform to them. 
Six of Wands, like, ew. Like, no. And they're an attention whore. Like, come on now. Choose one. 